Chris with Central Station Toys and CentralStationToys.com and we're changing things up. It's Central Station Toys and Games because we are launching our inaugural video for Warhammer Wednesday and I'm going to invite you to join me on our journey through the Warhammer community. Now we had Warhammer in the store for about six, seven months now and I'll be honest with you, when I got it and we got it in store, I knew nothing about it or at least very little about it. And as more and more of you have come in and started sharing your passion with us and talking about the different uh, uh, factions and groups within Warhammer, um, I've become much more interested in it and we are now launching our Warhammer Wednesday video series where I will be doing my journey through Warhammer. So if you're a beginner and have never done Warhammer before, come on the journey with me and uh, we're going to go through and just talk about different things that I've learned along the way. Um, we'll have my wife in sometimes because she's been learning some stuff as well. And we had a great time at the Warhammer store. You gonna come join in and say hi? No, I'm just kidding. Hi. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> but we had a great time at the Warhammer store and cafe uh, up in Grapevine, Texas, where they shared a lot of information with us. But you don't have to drive an hour and a half to Grapevine. You can stay right here in Cleburne and join us and get all your products here. So, what? we're gonna do now is use the start here, Warhammer 4000 uh, recruiter set. This is the base set that we have, 40,000, not 4,000, 40,000, uh, 41st century. Uh, Warhammer 40,000 recruit edition starter set. This is your base set. So if you're really just wanting to get your toe in the water, um, you can get a magazine that has two figures in it, or you can go with the recruiter set. This one starts at $50. Um, if you really want to get more into it, there's an Elite Edition that has a little bit more and then a Command Edition that is two full sets that will get you a full game going. Um, it's got some terrain and everything as well, but we'll talk about all that as we go along. So we're going to unbox the Recruit Edition because this is what we're going to have in the store. So if you want to come down and just kind of look around, learn how to play, this is what we're going to use. And that's why we've got it. Um, when I went to the Warhammer store, this is what they were using as a demo, and we're going to demo it here too. So, as we open it up, we've got some incredible stuff in here. So you already have your box to give you some height to it, your play mat, which we're going to open up the play mat and set it all up so that we can see how this all goes together. Now I've been told it is a two-sided play mat. So we're going to find out if that's true or not. Why would they lie to me though, right? <laughs> so you can see, you don't need a huge table to play with the basic uh, board. Um, we've got, what, uh, this is an eight foot table. So, you know, about half the table. So you can do this on a card table. Um, you do have two sided on here. So you've got the one side and then you've got your second side. Um, you can put this on as uh, extra terrain and have spaces on here, but that will get you going. The other thing that you have are some of your um, figures. So you're gonna have, it's not, it's not gonna be like a full game, but it'd be like a quick game. So this game, if you, with this figure, you'd take 30 to 60 minutes to play it, which is actually a good starter set if you're really looking just to start a little bit. So you're gonna have, um, this is going to be all Necron stuff, so you got uh, pieces to build your uh, Necron fraction, faction, not fraction. <laughs> and then you've got your pieces to buy your Space Marine uh, faction here. A um, little bit of both there. You've got your bases, you even have your dice. And um, so you'll be able to play the game. And then you've got two rulers, because uh, part of the game is how you roll the dice will get you how far you move. So you move how many spaces that you roll on your dice. So you have the two rulers to be able to do that. And these are just plastic little flimsy things. Uh, if you're getting into more tournament, tournament play, you're gonna want a full um, uh, tape measure, which we have in store now as well um, to do that. But this is a great little starter set. And then of course your recruiter manual, which will have the rules of the game um, and basic, the basic information for the characters that you have. Um, the starter set in and of itself is gonna be um, 
some work. And that's where we're gonna go with part two when we do our next video. Because we're gonna talk about painting, we're gonna talk about cutting, we're gonna talk about tossing and throwing and <laughs> anything, I don't know. <laughs> and this is the part that I'm worried about because I'm not a painter, but I have someone in my family who is, and they're probably gonna be doing the painting for me um, because I will probably get the bases in and uh, go from there. But luckily, there's somebody you. here who likes to paint and some friends of hers that like to paint that will probably paint these all up I think for you us. should do it to show people how easy it oh, is. Oh, I will do some, but um, easy? <laughs> have you watched the video? No. Uh, <laughs> no, it is. It is. Actually, if you and watch the If you watch the videos, videos it yeah. looks like it's very intense um and there you can make it super intense and detailed and everything else and you can do it very basic as well so there's no wrong way to do it well the other thing is that uh luckily games workshop makes it really easy with paints that help you put on textures exactly um, yeah layers and things like that so and the wonderful thing so easy. and these this these starter sets all three of them are some of the some of the the high-end sets i guess would be the right word uh, as you get further into the hobby um there's a lot of gluing that goes in lo involved with it but with these sets they're going to be just a snap together kit and um you just snap them together to build it so ultimately that's where we're going to go next week as we go through our journey is the building of the characters, the painting of the characters, and what you're going to need for that. So, for starters, great sets. If you're looking just to dip your toe into it, I would highly suggest the Recruiter Edition. If you're into Warhammer and haven't seen the new Recruiter Editions and you're trying to get a friend to join you, this is a great set to get him to, to join well, with. Well, this is also like a budget set. It is. I mean, this one's, go this one's like 50. Full on. You can go up to the next one. The, yeah. the Elite's $100. And this one is uh, two full armies. Um, and then if you go to the Command, it's 165 And with the Command Edition, you get um, extra pieces in there and terrain as well. So if you want to build up and make some things that look cool and you know, oh, you've got really some cool. extra stuff in here. Um, the reason we started with the with the recruiter set is because that's ultimately what we're doing here. We're recruiting you to Warhammer. So we want you to, to be able to play a game that takes 30 to 60 minutes. Um, some basic things. And uh, the one thing that, and this is what I would, this is what I, we were, one thing that we were talking about um, when we were talking about what we want to do with the video. Think of Warhammer as a video game system. So, yeah, you have that initial amount that you're going to put into your, your system. And you can buy, you know, you can jump in and buy $1,000 worth of stuff and go with it. But you can also buy the system by itself and one game and then you buy another game and then you buy another game and eventually you will probably be spending quite a bit of money into this hobby but you do it over time you don't have to do it all at once so you can take you know get your starter set get it painted up learn to play with the with one of the beginner sets and then okay you know okay i like this i want to try this faction i want to try this group i want to you know if you want to go to um you know, if you want to continue on with the uh, with the Necrons or the Space Marines, or if you want to go to another group, you can do that and go on with them. And that way, you do what you like and what sections seem great to you. If you don't want to do a full starter set, um, you can do a get started set. The get started sets have um, all kinds of different um, what do you call them? Species, I guess, mm -hmm. or their factions. There, you know, there's some. There's some very interesting, there's the Tau, there's the Skitari, there's the... Skink. Skink yeah, I mean, there's, there's probably stuff. 10, 15 different groups. And if you're into Warhammer, you can correct me anywhere down below in the comments. I know I'm messing this up and you're looking at it going, oh my gosh, this newbie. <laughs> it's okay, I'm a newbie, I admit it, but I'm learning from you. And uh, as I learn, I'm going to share for any other newbies that are watching this, we're going to come into this together. And we're announcing right now, anybody who wants to play Warhammer, our gaming section is open. The tables are here. If you want to get together with somebody and come set up on our tables, we can put two tables together. Um, it's not going to be... Um, 
you know, the wooden ones that you may find at some of the other stores that are all closed right now because you can't play, we're allowing you to play here. So if you want to bring a friend over, bring a buddy and play a game, we'll set up the tables and you can use it. If you can do it on an eight foot by, what is this, eight foot by three foot, that's fine. I know it's six foot by four foot is the official or some. I believe, I believe, I think it's six foot by four foot. <laughs> it's the official table. Uh, if we need to put two tables together, we can do that. But um, it's open for you. So if you want to come play at Central Station Toys in downtown Cleveland, Texas, you're welcome to do so. Um, we are open um, Tuesday through Saturday right now. And I'm more than willing to stay in on the evenings if you're wanting to come in and play. And just uh, I'll watch because I'm enthralled by this. And I'll watch a full game because I've not seen a full game yet. Anything, Dad? No, I'm excited. I know. It is going to be a fun, fun journey. Learning about it. We've been learning a little bit at a time. We figured we might as well jump in and start learning it. And while we're learning it and going along with it, we're going to bring you with us. So um, I'm going to be setting up on my recruit manual so I can figure out yeah. how to play this. We're going to get some paints going. So next week we'll be talking about the painting. And even though we're going to do a video about painting, there's a video every day posted by Citadel on how to paint these products because they're incredibly fun to watch they're quick three they minute are. videos um, really fun to watch. but they're they're enthralling so um, okay. yeah that's it for today all right our first Warhammer Wednesday is in the books we invite you to like and subscribe to our page and uh, follow us we're gonna post every Wednesday something new in the Warhammer community and we're gonna learn and bring you along with us and please feel free to send suggestions send emails comments in the section below tell me where I'm wrong tell me what the best fra uh, fa not fraction the best fraction is like one half right <laughs> the best faction is you know who's your favorite faction do you have how long you've been playing um, who do you collect and uh, what army do you feel is best because I think uh, we all want to learn together and grow and eventually yeah. we will have to rent this place to have a Warhammer uh, tournament here. That would be fun. That would be fun. So, all right. Thanks for watching. This is Chris with Central Station Toys. This is Stephanie with CentralStationToys.com. I don't know why, but it's Central Station Toys and Games <laughs> for all your fun things to do in Cleburne. All right, have a great night. Take care, guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> this is nice to have. <laughs>